Hi, I'm Joe Petro, the Director of Engineering at Infratech. The purpose of these videos is to make specifying and installing our products easier for you. Prior to installation or service of Infratech equipment, you'll need to disconnect all power at the main feed. You should also use a qualified electrician who's familiar with the National Electric Code. Now we're going to discuss troubleshooting a control panel that's not putting out enough heat. The first thing we need to do is check that you have the correct voltage for the rating of the heater. It would be very common to have a 208 volt feed for 240 volt heaters. With a 208 volt input, the heaters will not glow at full intensity. Once we've established that you have the correct voltage for the rating of your heaters, we need to empirically prove or disprove that the heaters are working properly. The first thing is to take the reading. Again, please write down the exact voltage, not round it up or round it down. The next thing, the next reading we need will be an amp reading. You'll need to take an amp reading for each heater and please record that number. After all of the heaters have been, um, amp readings have been taken, you turn off the circuit breaker and we'll need to take an ohm reading of the circuit, including the heater, so that we can prove that the heating element is the correct one for the rated voltage and the rated wattage. It will also show us if there's any problems in the wiring or in the circuit. So once we've determined that the heaters are working properly, we'll need to address your expectations. There are many factors that can influence your perception of heat with every installation. Could be the distance from the heater, prevailing wind, or your personal comfort level. Should you have additional questions or need assistance, please feel free to contact Infratech. Well, hopefully this video has been helpful. It's our goal at Infratech to provide the best products and the best information to make your installation a success. Should you need additional assistance, please feel free to contact Infratech.